Hello guys, welcome to this week's talk time. I know there was, you know, a couple weeks between each one. I'm gonna try and do better. You know, I usually do stuff on Friday, so what I'm gonna do is start, like I'm doing with this one, record it Thursday, and then um, have it scheduled to upload at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So yeah. So this week's topic is social media. And yes, I have to bucket down here to choose a topic. If you guys want to suggest topics um, for future videos, let me know. And if I don't really have it written down in here, I can add it. But yeah, so this week's topic is social media. Now, you guys know what social media is. It's Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, you know, Pinterest, all those type of stuff. Um, so we're going to talk about a little bit about today. Now, I mostly want to focus on like pros and cons of it. Because social media is not bad. That's the thing. Like, a lot of people like to say it's bad. Like, you know, yes, there are issues with it. But, I mean, like you said, there's with everything, there's good and there's bad about it, you know? So, that's the thing. I take everything with a grain of salt. So, what is social media? Social media are websites and applications that enable users to create and share content or to participate in social networking. You know? Um, the first social media site was born in 1997. And it was sixdegrees.com. I'll post a picture um, so you guys see what it looks like if you don't know what that is. Because I don't really know what it is. Um, you can create a profile, create lists of connections, and send messages within networks. So it seems like, you know, like kind of similar Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can post stuff, have a profile, and send messages. So, yeah. Um, so we have a few statistics. Um, the average daily uses of social media is 2 hours and 27 minutes. Um, so, I think that's right. Because, you know, I only check it a few times a day. And when I do it, I'm only probably on a few minutes to each time. So, kind of makes sense. Kind of seeing. Um, except YouTube. I know YouTube's considered social media. Um, I'm on that a a couple hours a day honestly so okay uh, six out of ten people on the planet have so a social media account the top 17 most popular so number one is facebook with um 2895 million then youtube with 200 2000 or 2 million i should say 2 million 2091 million no i'm just gonna say i was 2000 million for whatsapp instagram is 1,393 million. Facebook Messenger is 13 million. WeChat. Uh, now, I don't really know what WeChat is. It's um, 1,251 million. TikTok is 1 million. Or 1,000 million. Is that how you say it? I don't know. Do Doijin. It's D-O-U-Y-I-N. Doijin is 600 million. QQ. I don't know what that is. It's just QQ. F 591 million. Sina. Weibo, it's S I N A, and then W E I B O, five hundred sixty-six million. Telegram is five hundred and fifty million. Don't know what that is. Snapchat is five hundred thirty-eight million. Then this one is Q O K U A I S H O U, five hundred six million. Pinterest is four hundred fifty-four million. Twitter is three hundred sixty-three million. Reddit is four hundred four thirty million. Kiwa, Kio, Kroa. Q U O O A is two hundred million. Now I'm surprised Twitter is not more popular. You know, like it's up there with Instagram with users because I feel like Twitter is f relatively popular. But um, the most popular social media globally is Facebook. Age group percentage. So from eighteen to twenty nine, it's nine percent that use social media. Thirty to forty nine is eighty two percent. Um. 50 to 64 is, um, is 69 percent and 65 and over is 40 percent now gender percentage 65 percent of men use social media and 78 percent of women so more women use it than men um which makes sense now let me get into pros and cons there are some more pros and cons and i feel like the pros do kind of outweigh the cons um you know at the end of the day guys with social media it's just about being smart and being safe um, so some pros, um, you put yourself out there in a good way, you know, um, you can make friends that way, communicate, like, look at gaming community, people make friends through there, I've made friends through my YouTube, I talked to Colin, my editor, I've made friends through, 
I met him through social media, and I have a fan group chat from McJuggernaut's fans that friends with them that McJuggernaut connects us, so. Um, and you can connect with old friends and, like, family you don't get to see much, so. And you can uh, um, get different opinions on things, like, so in products and stuff like that, so that's good. Um, you can try and make a name for yourself, which you wouldn't want to do that. And you can help people, like, the, like for example, these videos I make, these talk times, I do it to help people, to inform people, to give people, you know, opinions and to help them. So, you know, you can help make a difference, people. It can bring people together, again, through, like, interest. Like, again, with McJuggernuggets, you know, it brought me and Juggy Ghost, Kalem, um, um, uh, um, Cosmic. Um, who else? Kareem, Jacob, all those people in that group chat br brought us together through Jesse. Um, you know, social media can educate people like on certain topics, like about certain things, about health stuff, about whatever it may be, about cooking, about making stuff, you know, education wise, like school stuff. Um, Six million Americans received help with major life issues from people in their social networks in 2006. And I'm sure that probably even gone up more over the years. Colleges can recruit you through videos you put on social media for sports. And I'm sure probably other stuff too nowadays. So, you know, that, that's another big con. I mean pro. Now the cons. Cons like people can post inappropriate pictures and statuses and like they can also... You know, post inappropriate pictures of other people, like revenge porn, it's called. So, just that, but, um, you know, it can make people feel bad about themselves, like with body image, stuff like that, personality wise, you know, intelligent wise. I get that, but, um, you know, there's cyberbullying, hacking, you could get hacked, gossip, and rumors could be spread that way, you know. And this is something interesting, which I don't know how much I, I believe. The use of social media sites can um, cause personality and brain disorders in children. Like the inability to have conversations. Um, limited attention spans. Um, the need for instant gratification, ADHD, and self-centered personalities. Um, so I don't know if I believe like that that could really happen. Everyone, like, says entitled to their opinion, whatever, but do you really think it can cause ADHD? Come on. Um, there's no way to verify who you're talking to online. So, like, you could be getting catfish, or someone can say they're, like, 14, but be, like, 45, you know. Um, so, that can leave people vulnerable to predators and stuff. Um, and then, if you don't have your accounts privated... People get private information, but with that one, just don't put private information on your accounts. Um, it usually tells, like, what it can tell you, like on Twitter, you can put, like, your birth date, you can put, like, your location, which I think it's stupid to have that as an option to put your location, but that's just me. You know, yes, there's cons, but again, there's good and bad to everything. You can't let the negative outweigh the good, you know? Because at the end of the day, good always out, good always beats evil. You know, and I get it. Sometimes, you know, if you're being bullied or rumors start, it's hard to ignore. But hey, this is life. Even if you don't, didn't have social media, like even just in school, rumors can spread gossip, stuff like that could still happen. So, you know, it's just about being smart and being safe about things and, you know, just being careful. You know, because these things can be avoided as long as you're careful. Don't give out, your, you know, information to anyone unless you super trust them. You know, just be smart about it, you know. Even if, like, you've been talking to someone for a couple of years on, through online. you never met in person. So be careful what you tell them. You know, even though you may think you know them, you know. It's still just about safety and being smart. Especially, too. When, because it's not just about you. It's about your family. Like, you gotta be smart about this. So, you know, I don't think social media is a bad thing. I think that I think it could have a lot of positives to it. Like, I told you the pros. You know. Like, you can really learn things from there, especially watching YouTube videos, Google, like, you know. And especially what's, what's going on in the world. Like, I, I always see things on Twitter about what's going on in the UK, the Ukraine, I mean. 
So, like, it can really help you. Like, you can really see what's going on in the world through social media. So, it's not bad. You know, the only time it could be bad is, like, when you're not being smart about it, you know. Like, don't get involved in other people's drama on social media because that's where it can turn bad. Don't let things upset you on social media, okay? You know, because at the end of the day, there's always going to be people who don't like you for whatever reason. You know, and you can't let that bother you. You got to keep persevering, you know. I think social media is a great thing. Like, obviously, you know, you gotta, can't have too much of a great thing. You got to limit your time on it and not be on it all the time. But I think if you limit yourself, you know, only go, go on it a little bit, then you'll be fine. But, you know, don't totally cut out social media from your life because you, you will be missing out on a lot of great stuff, you know. So I hope you guys take this. What I gave you and think about it, think things through. That was the mail. <laughs> um, but yeah. Hope you guys have a great weekend too. Let's pick the next topic to talk time to be a good one. I mean they're all good topics, but okay. it is Ooh, paranormal. Now I know I've done paranormal videos on there, but Paranormal is a great topic. Oh, fuck. Sorry about that little battery. I think it's a great topic, you know, and I think it's an interesting thing too, even if it's something you're not into or you don't believe. I still think hopefully you still watch the video, you know. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Follow me on my socials, guys. Follow Colin on Insta. Subscribe to Josh. Subscribe to Juggy Ghost. Subscribe to Always Sounds Good. Juggy, subscribe to Dan. Subscribe to Jacob. Um, subscribe to Colin. Guys, please subscribe to me. Please like and please comment so we continue to grow my channel. And I will see you randomers in the next video. Peace!